Hey what is up guys, Liam here aka MC Spartan and today I'm going to be showing you how to update your Astro 850 system with the mix amp. So the first step you will want to do is go to astrogaming.com slash firmware and this will give you your software so you can download it. Uh, you can either choose Mac or PC, all the steps are the same so uh, once you choose your uh, format of what uh, software you need uh, you should get a RAR file and it should say Astro Device Manager but uh, I'll give you some software that's free to download and it should open up this file so once you open it you want to double click on it and then go back to your browser and it should open up the application for you to update your Astros so you click OK to that and then it says transfer to the TX computer so you want to connect it to your PC or laptop either one doesn't make a difference so I'm going to show you how to do that right now Okay, so this is your first step to get your uh, mix amp here or transmitter, either one you want to call it. And on the back, you should see a power uh, little icon there. What you want to do is get your USB that comes with your Astro 50s and then plug it into there, like so. Then you want to get to the other end of the cable and then plug it into one of the free USBs on your computer, like so. And then afterwards, as you can see, it says if you have an A50 headset, just plug it into the back of the mix amp. So this is what you have to do, is get the other USB cable supplied with your A50s. And then you want to go to your A50s, and then at the bottom of them, there should be where you plug your charge charge kit. Like, you get two of these, so you want to plug the bottom one in, like that. Uh, it's the one next to the mic, so it's pretty easy to find. Then you want to get the other end of the USB cable, which is this end. And then you want to plug it into the back of this mix amp. So like that pretty much, so it, so it looks like that. So you've got one going from here to the A50s. And you've got this one going from here to the PC in one of your available USB slots. So now we go back to the PC. Right, uh, so now we're back to the steps on the computer now. Uh, it has the version uh, there, what I've got right now, and now what's available to update, and same for here. So we're going to go ahead and click update to the transmitter first. Uh, it's this one, it says it updates the ClearNet compatibility update. So you go ahead and update that device. Uh, start. It should not take very long, depending on their server and your internet connection. Don't worry about them sounds. It's all good. So it says when you've done this, you want to repair your headset. Like I'll show you how to do that after I've done the headset update as well. So that's that one up to date now, all uh, on four four one four three version. Now it's the headset. So I'm on three one five six in a minute, and then it's got to go up to four one four two. So click update again. This one has improved A50 mic audio quality, a noise gate, and clearing up compatibility updates. So we go ahead and click update. Start again. Should make them sounds if uh, maybe it might make them sound, so there's no need to worry about that. So let it do its thing. Okay, so the update's actually going now, so I had some problems uh, starting it, but I seem to have fixed it now. What I've done is just unplugged everything, plugged everything back in, restarted the browser, and it seemed to have uh, started again. But if you have any problems, don't hesitate to message me in the comments or private message. I do not mind helping out if I can, I do try my best every single time. But uh, once this is complete, it should say that all of this is updated. And I will show you how to sync your device back. So that is it for the computer side of things. So I'm going to go back now to the camera and show you how to sync your Astro 850s to the transmitter. Right, okay, so once you're done on the computer side of things, uh, this is how you want to sync back your device. So you've unpl unplugged the A50s from this. So you take unplug the cable okay, that went from here to the back. Uh, and leave the power cable in from your PC so you can uh, connect them back up. So what you want to do is hold it down this one until this button turns white, which is the power button. So you want to hold it down. And then do the same on your A50s. Hold that one down. On the power button. So that one flashes white. And this should pair up. You the A50s are now paired up, so uh, if you have any problems, as I said, don't hesitate to message me. And I uh, hope this has helped. If it has, don't forget to leave the like and maybe subscribe if you're feeling generous. And that is it from me, so I will see you in the next video.